I want to show you some of my other uh, contraptions here I was working on. This is a different Starship coil that I uh, made on the form, the Starship coil form. As you can see, it uh, I think it's 24 wraps of two. There's two circuits here. Um, just like you would on a normal rodent coil and uh, as you can see they're 10 degrees offset with your uh, void space there and uh, it's pretty cool looking uh, I made it on the form and then I hot glued it enough to let it so it would sit up and then uh, took the uh, pegs out and then made a form around that and uh, wrapped the entire thing so it's a solid form uh, it's pretty thin wire so I can't put much power through it but uh, it's definitely uh, an interesting looking coil that I made. Um, yeah, something I'll experiment with, I hope, later. Here's another. Uh, this is a true rodent coil. It's actually wrapped in interweaved um, where this one's just stacked on top of each other. I did wrap every leg uh, is wrapped on top of another and then another one another one another one, another one I didn't do like layers or anything it's actually two different circuits on top of each other so that's kinda interesting the way I, I've uh, made that one this one here is uh, gonna be pretty cool um, I have actually wrapped this on a super on the end here and this form that you see circle is actually a wire um, just wrapped up it's uh, I don't know how many turns it is uh, I don't know what gauge it is it's really thin you can see it there but uh, so I'm wrapping it around that to see what kind of voltages I can get out of the uh, the coil here um, I still have to wrap another one on there for my second circuit this is how much wire I used I don't know how long it is it's approximately 200 foot which is quite a bit this is uh, a ten and a half I'm sorry nine and a half inches across so uh, I wrapped it so tight that my uh, my uh, outer circle started to tweak a little bit there as you can see but uh, you can you can flatten it so what I'll do is uh, get some wood and put it around the outside so it's flat but it's wrapped pretty taut and uh, as you can see when I wrap this this side you can see where the uh, wire spins here and on this side it it looks like it doesn't that's because the way I looped it I went in and out the other side and it always twisted here and not in the center because it wanted to sit flat. So I'll probably go back and uh, try to twist those more directly in the center here. And then uh, get this other one wrapped see how that goes. Uh, in my next video, which will probably be a different posting, I'm going to send 12,000 volts out of a neon sign transformer directly to this coil. So I'm going to do that shortly. So uh, stay tuned. Watch my other videos. See ya.